What's up, Leo? It's Deb with Guys and Girls. I hope that you guys are doing really well. I hope that this video finds you safe. Go ahead and shut off the decks and get started. Okay. If you guys have been resonating with any of these stories, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, and then also hit the post notification bell on the way out. I would appreciate that. And if you guys haven't um, been able to resonate with this particular one, don't forget to check out my playlists, okay? Lots of timeless readings on there. <laughs> this is crazy. We got the Knight of Pentacles. And what's crazy is I just did Cancer's reading. And the reading was saying that uh, maybe a Leo... <laughs> was bringing an offer to a cancer so i don't know maybe if you are connected to a cancer go check out that reading after you watch this one also if you're new here and you want to know what the name of the decks are and information about the channel like the dates and the times of the post check that out in the description box. also got my instagram there too. The swords. Yeah, Leo. Are you the one that feels like you can't communicate? Because somebody feels entrapped. Either someone is entrapped or someone is locked up. But let's get some clarification. Because I only got two cards here. This could be heavy. What? Never in my life. You guys got a card reversed in this deck, and I don't even change, turn the decks. Like, I don't flip them. I, I only shuffle them the way you guys see me shuffle them. I'm going to show you what card it is. Devil card is my first card for you guys. The Six of Cups. The King of Wands. The Three of Wands. The Prince of Wands. <laughs> this is definitely fire sign. <laughs> this is you, Leo. The Five of Cups is in reverse. How did that happen? And the Three of Swords. Boom. This is heavy, okay. All right. Oh my God, I just myself. It's going to get a little tough. I can feel it. Okay. So, with the Devil card, you know, when you think about the Devil card, that can mean temptations, obsession, um, mischievousness, you know what I'm saying, things that are, and we have light and dark side, you know what I'm saying, so I don't fully feel like the devil's always bad, but we got the header as a devil card, and right next to it is the six of cups, so something in the past has been that type of energy for you, okay, you felt like you were in devilish energy, okay, and then this is you, the King of Wands. And the thing about the Leos, you guys, are the lions, you know what I'm saying? You're you're the ones that are considered the king of the jungle in some some places, you know what I'm saying? So we got the three of wands here. I feel like you're waiting for something and I feel like you're agitated because you don't want to be waiting, but you're frustrated because you want to build something that is stable. To me, this is the four of wands. Okay? You want to communicate to someone. You're bringing, trying to bring some communication. But I feel like in the past, you might have came off as the prince of wands. And that made people see you as not so stable, okay? Or it could be you were dealing with someone that was not so stable, okay? But I'm going to go by how I'm feeling, and that's what I'm feeling. Because... 
We got the five of chalice in reverse. This is unheard of. It. Like I said, my cards don't be coming out. And these cards particularly don't come out in reverse because I don't turn them in reverse. So somebody is overly sad right now. Somebody needs to get out of this energy because this is not good for their health. I feel like somebody's health is bad right now. Look, three of swords. This is heartbreak, heartache. Somebody might be slowly like giving up because they feel like their heart has been broken and people can die from heartbreak. Okay, Your heart's connected to your brain. Everything is connected. So it all affects each other. So whoever this is, I feel like they feel like their heart is broken because trying to offer something trying to offer something but they feel like they can't they they're blocked away from it or they're locked up locked away from it okay but it was because of some devil energy they had to pay the devil back okay they made a green you see this he came up to the devil or the devil came up to him one of the two but they are having a conversation in this card you know what i'm saying so somebody leo you or somebody else made some type of contract okay what's the devil five of swords fighting community um bad communication like arguments can be domestic violence, stuff like that. We got the Ace of Chalice, the Five of Pentacles, the Six of Wands, and the Nine of Wands. Okay. So, <laughs> this is connected to Cancer. It's crazy. It's got to be. It's really close. If it's not, if you're not dealing with cancer, just check out the cancer reading. I'm telling you. We got the Ace of Chalice. You, and I feel like the Ace of Chalice is coming here because self-love is what is needed, if you think about it. Okay. Because lessons learned from that. I feel like presently somebody is feeling left out in the cold. Maybe someone feels like they don't have enough finances to continue on with their journey. They're kind of just struggling. So that's why they come with the Knight of Pentacles type energy towards people because they don't have much themselves. It's like they're having a hard time meeting their needs. This could even be like a homeless person. But then we got the Six of Wands and I feel like, Leo, if you're not the person that's going through this, then you're winning and this is your element, fire. So. It'd be you, you know what I'm saying? But then there's also somebody that's feeling stuck, and this is also your element. So you choose, and you guys know who it is that is feeling like they're carrying the, the weight of the world. They feel beat up, battered, bruised, okay? So we got the Six of Cups connected to this with the Five of, of Swords. So someone. Phil is just over this this past situation, living this type of life, you know, possibly drinking and like overindulging and stuff. That's what I feel. Somebody was overindulging and got themselves hurt. What's the six of cups? The pinnacles. Wow. Interesting. I feel like hmm. the Ten of Pentacles was connected to your past. This was supposed to be your destiny, your legacy. But I feel like you had to stand in confidence and go with your inner truth. Because we got the King of Wands here. Wow. So this was tough. It was hard for you to let it go. You you feel like you fumbled the bag, basically. I mean, you feel like you just... 
literally this this means generational wealth like all that you could ever want okay what's the king of wands so it's like there, it was a, a situation where i guess the person that you're trying to offer to this person um, you maybe you know didn't offer it to them or I don't know what what happened, how that didn't work because of this other energy, this this contract that you have with, with the, this devil card, and it messed it up. So now it feels like you fumbled the bag. Ten of chalice now at the bottom. Yeah, the ten of pentacles, now I got the ten of chalice. Yeah, decisions, two of wands, six of pentacles, who you worked with, who you decided, and you chose money. Not you, so you know the other way around. They chose money. They chose collaborations. But look at look at the money that they chose. Over the ten, they chose a three. So there was people that came to them, told them, oh, let's make some money, man. You know what I'm saying? And that's what they chose versus their generational wealth. Wow. Could have been family members with the ten of chalice right here. So it could have been people in their family that they trusted or they loved. You know what I'm saying? These people were in this energy, that devil card energy. All right, what's the three of wands? Let me know, you guys, if you like the style that we're. Doing the reads and now. King of Wands. This King of Wands card is getting wore out. <laughs> he getting wore out because he's been working. Okay. He was in Cancer's reading quite a few times. So, this is the thing. Somebody is waiting on their stability. And this could be you, Leo, waiting on your stability because of uh, this action that you took that was foolish. You know what I'm saying? You fed yourself to the crocodile or they fed themselves to the crocodile because they were very, um, let's say you, you want stability now, but you were un very unstable at one time. So like player type energy or... Like in and out, going after whatever is exciting, what looks good, you know, stuff like that. But now you've matured to the king of, uh, king of wands from the prince of wands. So we're going into the prince of wands energy. What was this? Why was it doing this? What was this? <laughs> wow. The Knight of Chalice. Hmm. So, so you didn't want to be seen as the soft person, basically. So you held back your emotions because you wanted to be a star. You wanted some type of fame. Mm -mm. Clearly, it didn't help. Five of Cups in reverse. Yes. That... that that didn't get you the star that you wanted, but now you have to heal, okay? I'm trying to get something positive out of this. And this is a star card, which is healing. So that means now it's time to heal. You know what I'm saying? It's time to mature this emotion. You're you're going after the ace of chalice with the knight of chalice type energy. That's not going to match, okay? Because the knight of chalice, he sometimes stops and takes a drink of his chalice. The Ace of Chalice has water that overflows, and that's coming from themselves, their self-love. So you have to mature. What's this Five of Cups with you? Wow, the Ten of Pentacles came out again in the Ace of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you feel like you dropped the bag or they feel like they dropped the bag. 
that the divine has given. This was a gift from the divine. This Ten of Pentacles, this past situation. You see that the card, no card came out on that. But the Ten of Pentacles is showing up again. You know what I'm saying? That hurt, the pain and stuff from losing this. But it's really like, I feel like this person ain't even really sad about the person. They sad about the money because there is no hardly any emotion out here. Like you want a water sign, but where is all the water? Literally, it's right here. But that's a that's just saying how you messed it up, not doing it right. Okay, let's let's clean. Let's get some advice, and I mean, we get the end of it so we can figure this out. Okay. So totally clearly, ten of pentacles, three of swords. I'm heartbreak but like i said i feel like it's over finances and not actually emotions what's the three of swords first card what is this card five of wands <laughs> you best believe it if you're talking about a cancer, this empress right here, yes, they got options. Yes, with the five of wands, yes. And you know what I'm saying? If it's you, Leo, that's the empress, you do, you have options. And I feel like whoever this person is that has the options is probably going to check their options out because I'm sorry, but the three of swords, somebody is not going to be feeling it. Somebody is not going to be happy, but that's that's what it all comes down to. I feel like somebody is going to have to get themselves out of this Eight of Swords energy right here. You know what I'm saying? Because they, they did something up against the Empress. This person is divinely protected. This is like the Earth, Mother. You know what I'm saying? You can't continue to harm and not have to pay for that. So I don't know who this is for, but this is where I end. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, hit the post notification bell and wake out. And until next time, I'll talk to you guys later.